Hi there, I'm Wendy. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So if you're new here and you like this type of content, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification to get notified of all my future uploads. So today we're gonna jump right in and take a look at a snack subscription box. So let's just jump right to it. Okay, so we're gonna jump right in and take a look at Snack Crate, and this is a monthly snack subscription, and this is what it looks like when it shows up at your house. Um, they have boxes that start at $9.99. I believe this one costs 20 something USD um, a month. And what it is is you get snacks from around the world. You never know which one you're gonna get for that month. So when you open it, this is what it looks like, and you can see there, these are snacks from Thailand. And what you have in here is you're gonna have a little um, piece of paper that goes over all the different items that are in your snack crate. So let's just get to it. Um, this looks like a bag of lace. Um, obviously it looks like two different um, flavors. And it's a, oh man. It says Lay's shrimp and seafood. It says these crispy, crunchy potato chips pair distinct flavors of freshly grilled prawns with Thailand's signature seafood chili sauce. Y'all, I don't even eat, I don't eat seafood. I mean, I'm not allergic to it or anything. I just don't like the flavor. Uh, oh my God. Listen, I'm gonna take a, a teeny tiny bite because this stinks like seafood. Oh my gosh, this is disgusting. Mm -mm. Y'all, that tastes like, really does taste like shrimp. I can't. Oh my, that better be the, woo -hoo, I don't want anything else seafood. Oh my goodness, no. This next thing, oh my hands smell like it now, y'all. Ugh. The next thing on here is menorah and it said fried pumpkin chips. And it says these chips have a light and airy texture that will keep you munching and crunching on their pumpkin -y goodness until the whole bag is gone. So it helps if I could actually get the bag. I know I struggle on these. Let's just get my scissors. Because this isn't working. There we go. Oh my. So this is what they look interesting. Um, they just kind of taste airy. I don't really, they don't taste like pumpkin. I don't know what that flavor is. I feel like I've had it before, but it doesn't taste like pumpkin. These two are also puffed up like those last ones. I don't know what this is. This is what it looks like. And it says, let me find it on here, maybe. Woo -hoo -hoo. No, it's not on here. Okay, that's, that's interesting. It's not on here, but we'll go ahead and give it a try. Looks like some corn nuts. And it says peanut coconut cream flavor coated. I don't know. I don't like coconut either. I don't know, I don't know what these are. Kind of tastes like peanuts. They don't taste like coconut. We're on. We're just gonna keep that moving, y'all. Mm. Okay. What it, oh my gosh, this is probably some seaweed situation. This is called Big Roll, and if you, I don't know if I can get it close enough. You see what he's holding? It looks like seaweed. <sighs> you don't have to be a green sea turtle to enjoy this nutritious snack. We've included either the spicy or the grilled seaweed flavor variety. Dang it. Listen, I've tried seaweed before. I'm not a big fan. Oh my goodness. Oh, uh, look at this. Y'all. <sighs> Have you guys tried seaweed before? Let me know down in the comments what you think of it. it smells like seaweed. Man. No. Ugh. No. Uh -uh. That tastes just like the, the seafood chips. Oh, I can't. I can't, y'all. Mmm. I cannot get that taste out of my mouth. Please let there only be sweet stuff left. Um, because I'm not going to make it. Here's the next thing, y'all. 
This is dynamite. Let's see if I don't even... Dynamite candy. Good. I found it on here. So dynamite candy, this tasty surprise, prepared to blow you away. This mint flavored hard candy is exploding with a creamy chocolatey feel, filling. Also, they're individually wrapped. Listen, my, my mouth still tastes like this anyway. Mm. All right, let's pop this open. Okay, so yeah, they look white. Tastes like a, a mint that you would have at like Christmas time. You know, peppermints that are red and white. That's what it tastes like. And then that chocolate, the creamy chocolate filling, you don't really taste it. Slight hint of chocolate at the end. Okay. All right, let's go. Here's the next one. We have Lush. And it is Lush chocolate. It only takes one bite to flood your mouth with flavor. These luscious taffy-like candies are quite literally bursting with a chocolatey drizzle. Listen, I'm just glad we got to some candies. These two are individually wrapped. Oops, I just about dropped it. Okay, so it kind of looks like a Tootsie Roll. Mm. It kind of tastes like a Tootsie Roll right at the beginning. Hmm. Has more of a chocolatey flavor than Tootsie Roll. But nothing like gooey or creamy or anything like that. Those are good. Mm -hmm. The next thing I see in here is Jelly Yo-Yo. And this says, a refreshing, cool, crisp bottle of cola in a chewy, gummy form. Great paired with a movie. This tasty treat surely won't last long. All right. Okay. These two are individually wrapped. Which, that is very surprising for some gummies. Alrighty. There are several items. I just glanced in the box. There are still several items in here. Oh, that's huge. Look at that. For a gummy. Oh, it definitely tastes like cola. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's not bad. Um, you know, I just don't eat a lot of gummy stuff, but it's not bad. Hmm. The next thing here... No, I don't see it on this at all, but these are little candies. Um, I can't read what they are. Let's see here. Yeah, those little, those little cola jellies, those were good. If I can get this out. Oh, it's like another hard candy. Doesn't really have a scent. Kind of like mango-y. Mmm. It's pleasant. I don't. I can't put my finger on it, but it's not terrible. Hmm. Yeah, that's really good. Mm-hmm. Really good. Okay. So the next thing I see in here, I'm going to pull these out because I've had these before. These are Prez sticks. So there's a corn and a larb flavor. I don't really know, but I've had these before. They're good. So um, I'll take a little bite of each one because usually I've tried like the Italian varieties. So they're just like little breadsticks. These are baked, not fried. Okay, so this does taste like corn. That's not very good. But the, I'll tell you, the Italian ones, they are good. What is this? This is lard flavor. So I'm going to assume it tastes like that picture. Oh, I usually don't get nervous when prezzes are in here, but now I'm nervous. Mm -mm -mm. What is going on, y'all? Now that doesn't really have a flavor. So that way it's got like little, little salt, little heat. Woo, a little heat, a lot of heat. At the back end, a lot of heat at the back end, you know. Again, I don't eat a lot of spicy stuff at all, so it's okay. All right, the next thing in here we have, um, it's called United Almond. Obviously it looks like strawberry and chocolate almond. And this is what the sleeve looks like. Okay. That's different. Oh my gosh, this is not what I expected at all. Look at it. Not at all, y'all. So, 
One almond. It smells very strawberry. Mm, different. No. Yeah, I'd eat those. Those are good. Mm -hmm. Light. So when you first put it in your mouth, you taste that strawberry. Obviously, with it being pink. The last note is chocolatey. So it's a very nice, smooth flavor. Mm, that's really good. The next thing here, these are some cookies. I think I might as well just give up looking for things on here. So these are some cookies. Give these a whirl. These look like, um, they say vanilla on the side. So, they kind of remind me of, like, like an Oreo cookie. Hmm. They don't taste like an Oreo, but, I mean, they're not horrible. Not horrible at all. Ooh. Okay, we have three more things in here. Oh, maybe four more things. All right, so the next thing in here is Bing Bing. Oh, it is on here, and this is crispy wafer sandwich with a coconut cream and coated with rich white chocolate. Makes this snack a true tropical treat. So, now I'm not a big coconut fan. Y'all, I am like an extremely, extremely, extremely picky eater. So, you know, this always gives me a little bit of anxiety when I'm going to do these. Oh, okay, look at that. All right. Yeah, I took a little baby bite. Definitely tastes like the wafer cookies that um, we have here, but that's very coconutty. So if you like coconut, you will really like that because it has a strong coconut flavor. What else is in here? This, I don't know what this little guy is. I feel like I've seen that before. And I don't see it on here either. So, oh wait, there it is. It says Sun Snack Dunk. Savory roasted sunflower seeds coated in rich, delicious, and yet unusually, an unusual combination of sweet corn and cheese flavoring. Like, why can't I ever get in these packages? Like, on the struggle bus, come on. Okay, let's get in here and try this. So they just look like, you know, like little sunflower seeds. You definitely can taste the sweet corn. I don't really taste the cheese flavor, but I mean, they're, they're okay. But I say like, why mess with, why mess with sunflower seeds, right? Let's see what else we have in here. Two more items. Mentos, which we do have Mentos here in the United States. And this says soda mix, which we don't have this variety. So they just look like our Mentos. This one's purple. Hmm. So these are really hard. Hmm. Very grapey, is that a word? Grapey, it's very grapey. But it's not bad. Okay. Our last item, y'all. This looks like gum. I looked. It's not on. It's not on the sheet. So let's just pop this open. All right. All right. So, but it feels like I don't know if it's gum or taffy. And again, you know, we're just going all in because we don't know what it is. That's what it looks like. It smells like vanilla-ish. It's definitely taffy. Vanilla taffy is what it tastes like. Very hard, very hard. But, um, I mean, it's not bad. All right, there you have it. There are all the snacks from Thailand, and obviously I struggled with some of the seafood ones, um, but this is just to show you all, once you get your snacks pulled out, there's all these different fun facts and information about the country um, the box is from. So it's really fun if you wanna do it by yourself, with your kids, what have you. But again, you know, it's a good time. I don't, I don't know how much longer I'll be able to keep doing this, y'all, because I do struggle with being such a picky eater, but I do have a good time with it. Let me know if you've tried Thailand's box or received Thailand's box from uh, Snack Crate down below in the comments. So until we talk again, talk to you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.